Hey guys, what's going on? It's Clever Tiki, and in this video we're gonna learn how to create a carousel in Bootstrap 4. A carousel is a slideshow for cycling through a series of pictures built with CSS and a little bit of JavaScript. As usual, don't forget to include jQuery and both Bootstrap CSS and Bootstrap JavaScript. Now the first thing we're gonna do is to create the main div for our carousel, and I'm gonna give this carousel an ID of magic carousel, which we're going to reference later when we create the indicators and previous next controls. Next, we're going to add two bootstrap classes. The first one is going to be carousel, which simply says that this div contains a carousel, and the second one is slide, which uh, will add a CSS transition animation effect and make the next item slide into view. The second attribute that we're gonna use is data ride with a value of carousel. And this is telling Bootstrap to begin animating the carousel immediately when the page loads. Okay, so this is our main div carousel. Now we're going to define another div which will hold all of our carousel items and list them horizontally. I'm going to uh, create this div here and apply a class name to it called carousel inner. And we're also going to use a role attribute and apply list box value. Okay. And now we're ready to create our carousel item divs, which will hold the images and captions. So this div is just simply going to have a class called carousel item. And now inside of this div, we're ready to put the put in the actual image, which is going to have two classes. So image class equals D block, which is used to align the image properly. And the second one I'm gonna use is W-100, which sets the width of the image to 100. Next, we're gonna define a source for the image destination. In my case, it's IMG Cinderella.png. I'm also going to add a alt attribute to the slide and call it first slide. Now we're also going to create a caption for this carousel by adding another div just underneath the image with a class name carousel caption, which is self-explanatory. Just tells Bootstrap that it's going to have a caption inside of this div. And uh, inside of this div, I'm gonna put an h3 tag for the heading of the caption, which is going to be Cinderella. And a paragraph with a short description, I'm just gonna say first slide. All right, at this point, I'm just gonna copy and paste this code five times for the carousel item, because I'm gonna have five slides. Just gonna align these divs properly, just to keep it neat and organized. And now I'm just gonna replace all the values with different ones. So this one's gonna be second slide. This one's gonna be third slide. fourth and fifth. Now I'm gonna replace the image names. Rapunzel. This one's gonna be Snow White. Next one is Red Riding Hood. And the final one is Unicorn. I'm also going to replace these names here and replace the slide name, the second slide. That one's third slide, Red Riding Hood is the fourth slide. 
and finally unicorn is our last five fifth slide one last thing to add here is active to one of the carousel items so i'm just going to add it to the first one and now let's go ahead and see what the carousel looks like and this is our carousel so far let's see if it starts sliding the next and it does so the carousel is working so it's automatically sliding next uh, picture item into view the next thing we're going to add is the previous and next controls which are links so we're going to create a tags and i'm going to go ahead and uh, add these right after the last carousel item so let's go ahead and uh, create the first a tag this one is going to have a carousel control previous and for the href we're gonna reference our magic carousel main don't forget the pound in front of it it's gonna have another attribute called roll equals button and data slide previous okay now we're going to add two span classes inside of this link which will hold the text and the icon the first one is gonna have class name carousel control prev icon just gonna be empty and the second span class is gonna have a class named sr only which indicates that uh, this text that's gonna be showing up here is for screen readers only so the only thing that's gonna be showing up is the icon and uh, for the next, all we have to do is uh, copy this whole code and pretty much replace the word previous with next. So, place next, 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 and next. Okay, let's go ahead and test to see if everything works. Here are uh, previous and next controls and everything is working great. Now the last thing we're going to add are the carousel indicators. And uh, if I go back to the completed carousel and view it here, you can see these indicators at the bottom of the carousel which uh, tell us which current uh, carousel item we're currently viewing in order. And you can also click on these to take it to the next and uh, previous carousel items so we're gonna put the carousel indicators inside of the main div and just outside of the inner carousel list box uh, it's gonna have uh, an ordered list with a class called carousel indicators inside of our ordered list we're going to place list items with an attribute data target which will target our name of the carousel, which is pound magic carousel. Another attribute we're gonna use is called data slide two, which specify which slide to go to when clicking on a specific indicator. And it starts its count at zero for the first carousel item. I'm also gonna set this class to active to start our carousel at this indicator. Now I'm just going to copy and paste this four times. Going to delete class active from the rest of them. And change the values incrementally by one. Now let's go ahead and view the carousel. All right, you can see uh, the indicators showing up at the bottom here, and you can click on any of them to take us to that specific carousel item. The previous and next controls are working, and our carousel is complete. And that's how you make a carousel in Bootstrap 4. I hope you guys liked this video. Please like, share, and subscribe. Clever Techie out.